Hello and welcome. You're watching Beyond World is One with me, Ananya Datta. And in this broadcast, we will be focusing on every single developments coming in from Bangladesh. But first up, the headlines. Nobel laureate Mohammad Yunus named as the head of Bangladesh's new interim government. He lands in Dhaka from Paris and is to be sworn in later today. Humanitarian aid sent into Russia's Kursk region amid a Ukrainian incursion towards setting up temporary accommodation centers. Russia declared a state of emergency in the border region after the biggest attack by Kiev's forces in months. Ambassadors of G7 countries in Tokyo will skip the Nagasaki atomic bomb memorial anniversary on Friday after Japan decided to exclude Israel's envoy from the event. Catalan separatist leader Carlos Puigdemont returns to Spain after seven years in self-imposed exile. He had fled from Spain over his role in a failed 2017 independence bid for the region. Police patrol streets of Nairobi as pro-reform protesters prepare to revive nationwide marches and protests. 39 people were killed in clashes with police as they protested planned tax hikes which the government later abandoned. India's central bank leaves benchmark interest rate unchanged as expected. Policymakers worry that high food prices will continue to keep inflation above its target. Disqualified Indian Olympic wrestler Vinesh Fogart announces her retirement. The Haryana state government says it will treat Vinesh Fogart on par with an Olympic silver medalist and award her the same prize money as facilities. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.